So, you're going to put a size 12 caddis hook in your vise and start with a thread that's close enough to the grandum caddis as you can get. Look at the grandum caddis in your area, the colors of them, and just try and get a thread that matches that. Because basically that's the main body of the fly. Oh, in my area, that's like a neon green. Uh, it's pretty much close to the color you could see right in the video. That matches pretty close. The camera caught that color pretty close. Um, so just look it up in your area. And, but that's my color. It's probably your color in your area. Neon, like a neon green. Almost a chartreuse. This video is brought to you by Young's Taxidermy. Go check them out for all your taxidermy needs. Thank you very much for considering them. You're doing a uh, building your body up here to make it look like a worm. And then you're going to tie in black thread right behind the eye of the hook. Because we're going to finish the fly with black thread. I'll explain that to you before the end of the video. Now you're going to tie in a peacock hurl. And I like to take one down the middle of the feather, not up by the eyes. I don't want this to be too poofy. Just a little bit of fluff here. So I tie it down towards the, the butt of this feather. Not towards the eye, the opposite end of the eye actually. So you want the head of this fly to be uh, black. So that's why we tied in the black thread and used it to tie down the bodies, the bo thread that made up the body. So now it has a black head and that's kind of what you want. You don't want it to be a fluorescent head. Okay, now you want to hit this with your Sally Henson's or your UV. UV works really good as long as you use a thin coating of it. But you're going to hit this so that the teeth of the fish don't break your thread every time the first fish you get. So cut it down with some head cement or whatever you want to use to coat it. Okay, I hope you liked that video. And the reason that video is, our video is premiering is you can see, so you guys can ask questions. Every Monday when these videos pr premiere, you guys can ask questions while the video is playing. So you can ask tying questions. I'll be here to ask your questions. I'll make comments. You can talk to me while the video is playing. So keep that in mind. That's why we're premiering these videos. And I uh, hope you like the other videos that appear up here. 
These are great. Last year we seen one on our boot in March on Spring Creek. We seen one cling to our boots. And then we went home and researched because I didn't know the Granum Cast was quite that bright, vivid green that it is. So get these tied, get fishing with them now. I got our, we got ours in our box, we're ready to go. So, get them tied up, be in your box, you might need these. Keep your lines wet, out of the trees, and only give them fish a sore lip. And like and subscribe and comment because it helps us. You have a good day.